let me briefly explain how differential from M4 works. Unlike previous BMW models, it is clutch type LSD unit, but with one big difference. It has servo motor right here, which engages clutches through this system. Let's now check how this works. Now you have the full capacity on the clutch stack and the differential is completely locked. But what is the main problem with this setup? When the motor is not engaged, you don't have LSD at all. As you can see, I can completely freely spin those wheels in the opposite direction so you don't have limited slip differential. This causes a delay on the racetrack that you definitely do not want and desire. Let's check when we go to the half of this ring, what happens? You can still spin opposite wheels. So until the full load and the full capacity, you have quite amount of time until it is engaged 100% that you want, like this. Now you can't spin the differential. But another problem occurs with this system. It has a lot of free play in the clutch stack that you can see here. That provides the delay that is not desirable for this system. It also provides a clunking noise, famous M clunk. You can see right here. So we got two bad things to deal with. What we at Racing This actually did. We provide a free play delete shim, which is installed behind this spider gear, which kills that free play. And we have spherical shim that we install right here at the beginning of the clutch stack that provides a minimum of 80 Newton meters of breakaway torque. So we have more mechanical feel. Of course, we change the clutch stack within our set. So you have completely revised system of functionality of this differential. This applies to whole range of F-series differentials like M2, M3, M4, M5, and M6 within the same generation. So it is quite usable on and off the racetrack. Check more details about this system on racingdivs.com. See you in the next video.